the gentleman expert legion here and we're back again with another doors video so i want to actually i've never done a video about this just gonna quickly do a door 50 guide um because i know a lot of people haven't gotten past door 50 because of how difficult it is it's actually not difficult at all um there's a certain path that you usually want to take uh i do this uh path usually when i'm speed running like solo uh, so you start going on the right, you go left. That's just this one path you take, that's it. Right, you want to look for books, you want to make sure your volume is up and high, so you can hear the sparkling noise of those books. Um, be careful, figure. Um, there's different path finding to him, right? Sometimes he walks over here, which he is doing that right now for some reason. That's like the rare path finding that he usually does. Because usually his uh path finding will be hold on so usually he'll go in the middle that's his path finding he'll go in the middle over here and then he'll go over to like the right side or the left side it's just based oh no he's going from the middle now that that was a rare case of him moving y you know as the more you play the more you know basically uh, trials and error but this is just from my experience, if you want to like easily uh, catch on. Really, Timothy, I just picked up a band-aid a few m seconds ago. Yeah, so that's basically it. He'll go upstairs usually, he'll be around this area. Once he's upstairs, you can actually walk if you want. If he's behind bookshelf like that, he can't really see you, you can just run for it. Make the game a bit quicker. So, so just follow the path I'm doing. Right, it's the speedrun path is probably the best path you can take to get all the books. Seriously, all the books upstairs. That's a new one. Yeah, so when he's upstairs like that, you can just run. You can do whatever. He can't get you. But once he's downstairs or in the stairs section, I don't recommend you doing anything. As you can see, pretty easy. He doesn't do much doesn't attack you when you're walking but once he's going down the stairs do make sure you're crouch hi mr figure right so also uh one of the things i've noticed is when you pick up the first book that's usually the first code on the notes so as you can see here this there's an o there's already an o it's guaranteed to be like that oh jeez it's guaranteed the first book that you pick up will be the first go code that goes in the lock. That's very simple. And the last book that you pick up is also the last code on the... The last book, sorry. The last book that you pick up will be the last code. First book, first code. Last book, last code. Uh, pretty simple to remember. remember. All the middle ones are all over the place. There's no really pattern into it. You can't really tell the middle one. But you can 100% sure tell so here's the last one five i would think it was a triangle there you go triangle pretty simple like i said last code is the first first code is first first book is first code last book last code pretty simple remember uh figures pattern is also pretty simple so half the times you don't even need to go into the closets to stay alive as you see you only use the closet when it's a really emergency thing right if you have teammates and they're stuck in the closet you can use that time to make a run for it you don't have to stay crouch uh yeah so that's pretty simple if you guys have any questions about door 50 please put them in the comments um i'll answer them i know it's pretty confusing when i'm explaining it but i'll probably do best at explaining it on text so just hit uh, put your questions in the comments and I'll try to answer them. Uh, please, if you enjoy my video, please hit that like button. If you're new around here, please hit that subscribe button as well. I really appreciate appreciate you guys' support. And as always, everyone, have a nice day. Bye.